Hello and welcome back to the Fat Hipster channel. It's me, John, and today I'm going to be trying these two new Mountain Dew flavors. Mountain Dew, you know, probably like five years now, has just been coming out with flavor after flavor after flavor after flavor after only having like two flavors for forever. And one thing they've been doing this last summer and this summer is coming out with new Baja flavors. Baja Blast, of course, being the original, originally being a Taco Bell only uh, flavor, but eventually coming out in cans and bottles, going in 7-Eleven and slushies, and even having a diet version. Well, this summer they're back again with another round of Baja flavors. I think last year there was like a pineapple and maybe like a mango flavor, as well as the regular Baja. Um, and this year, again, they're, they're coming out with a regular Baja with the Zero Sugar Baja. But these two new flavors as well. And we're going to try them. This is Baja Passion Fruit Punch, which comes in a purpley color. And Baja Caribbean Splash. Now, the Caribbean Splash says it is a guava flavor. I don't know why the passion fruit flavor one specifically is passion fruit, but the guava flavor has to be called Caribbean. I'm sure it's something they debated in marketing to say it will sell better if it's it's if it's Caribbean uh, on the title instead of guava. Maybe guava has a negative sales connotation. Who knows? I'm not a marketing person, but I'm sure someone in marketing made that decision. Uh, which one should we try first? Mini Mini Mo, Passion Fruit Punch. I'm going to pour it into a cup because these are cans, so I want you to see the color as well. Both of these contain 0% juice, just in case you were wondering if Mountain Dew uh, decided to use any of real uh, fruits in this. Though it does say natural and artificial passion fruit flavor. Um, I'm not sure what artificial passion fruit flavor is made of um, in the ingredients. There's nothing uh, out of the ordinary. Let's go ahead and pour. So as you might know, there's already like a purple uh, Mountain Dew flavor, the uh, pitch black. And this one is a much lighter purple. And I can tell looking through my uh, camera view that it's coming off very blue through the camera. Whereas when I'm looking at it, it is more lavender color. If you've ever had a real passion fruit, it's not very strong in either smell or flavor. It's a very light uh, fruit. It comes in a white variety and a red variety. Um, it's, the pictures on here don't really do it justice. Maybe I'm thinking of dragon fruit. I might be thinking of dragon fruit. Passion fruit might look more like that. And I may be wrong. I should have looked that up beforehand. Anyway, let's taste it. If someone hands you this and said, guess the flavor, I doubt you're going to say passion fruit. It is ambiguously fruity flavored. Um, apparently, naturally and artificially flavored is passion fruit. Did they have the person tasting passion fruit and then tasting this to make sure it tasted like passion fruit? Maybe who's to say, but I can guarantee you uh, at least 95% of people out there buying these don't really have a good estimation of what passion fruit is supposed to taste like anyway. With that being said, it tastes fine. Um...
fruity, caffeinated beverage. Could be a Mountain Dew, could be a Fanta, could be a Crush. But in this case, it is Mountain Dew. Let's go ahead and try the next one. Caribbean Splash. Guava flavored. Out of these two, I've probably had guava the most recently. Um, a lot of things in some... I'm not sure which uh, Latino uh, cuisine has a lot of guava in it. Might be Brazilian. Might be Dominican. Might be all of them. But uh, there's this dish where it's like guava paste and cheese and like a Danish. And that's very good. Let's go pour this into this. It is more pink than red. The can is kind of pink. The drink is very pink. And again, through my camera, I can see that this is coming off. This is very orange. But when I'm looking at it directly with my own eyeballs, it's very pink. Now that I could say smells like guava. But again, more recently, I've had guava than passion fruit. And it tastes like guava. Oh yeah, I could see if you were a fan of whichever cuisine I can't remember that has those uh guava paste cheese tarts whatever the name that they are actually are you would like this as well very tasty if you've had guava and you like guava you'll say this tastes like guava Anyway, that's it. We have the passion fruit uh, punch and the Caribbean splash. My favorite is definitely the passion fruit, uh, the Caribbean splash, which is supposed to taste like guava, and it does. Um, passion fruit punch is not bad. Uh, it's just not. Maybe it is. Maybe it tastes like passion fruit. Maybe I should have recently tasted the passion fruit before this. And I would know better. But I don't. And that's the review. That's what you're watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Let me know if you've tried either of these. Um, what is the next year? I'm sure they're going to have another range of Baja flavors. What weird fruit should they do then? Hopefully not durian, because that is disgusting. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and watch all my videos. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.